Hello gamers, we are straight in today. You see this pet right here, the Tatsu Worm? Remember it used to be a tier 4, then they made it tier 3, and it basically is like a lower level snake. Uh, it'll deal damage to the first enemy when the friend, ahead, friend ahead faints. It'll double that damage if it's level 3. So I thought, I have a very interesting build. You can see my pack, maybe you can take a guess at what I was thinking. Uh, and then this run is not that run. Don't worry, at the end I'll show you a bonus clip of what I was trying to do. But I thought this run was significantly more interesting. Uh, and basically you can just view this as like the Wombat Domination run. The Wombat was never meant to be part of this build. I mean, the Wombat could be part of any build. It is the best bet in the game, but... Uh, the shop sort of like said, Rev, you need to run Wombat. And I hap happily obliged. I am not a... Uh, I respect the shop. You know, like a uh, play the hand you're dealt sort of thing. Uh, I'm playing hands, baby. And uh, Team Wood was a dealing. <laughs> I regret that so much. So... <laughs> Full disclosure, I don't really remember this run. All I remember is that I'm going to level up into a Babusi. And then the shop is going to give me a Wombussy. Three of them, in fact. Insanity. I skip one, I skip two. You know that I'm, like, locked in when I'm skipping Wombats. The shop says, Rev, you, uh, you skip one, you skip two, uh, fool me once, uh, shame on, the, you know, that whole thing. And I'm like, okay, I'll oblige, I'll take a Wombat. Who am I to say no? Why do I not remember this run, other than that moment? I recorded this late at night on, uh, I'm gonna say Monday. Tuesday, I don't know, sometime earlier this week. I woke up at 3am with Vertigo. Have any of you had Vertigo before? This is my first time. It's so bad, man. It's the worst. It just totally sucked butt. Like, why am I going slow? I like, woke up at 3am, and how do I explain this? My mattress is here. And then there's like a bed head, and I put my water on top of the bed head. So I've like turned backwards like this and reached up to get the bottle of water. And it's hard to explain, but can you even see this? I like reached up, and basically my head was going this way, and then suddenly the whole world was going that way. Like this. And I got on my hands and knees. Imagine like you've never had vertigo before, suddenly your whole world is spinning. I'm like on hands and knees and then suddenly here comes the nausea, here comes the vomit. I get to the bathroom. Now I know what vertigo is. And I'm like, okay, my whole world is spinning. I have to have vertigo right now. Um, by the way, Wombat copying Hoopo Bird. Incredible. Nice loss as a result for you. Uh, yeah, so I had vertigo. And I wasn't able to record today. I finally feel human again today. Inshallah, God willing, I'll never get this again. And I rip it into an elk. You know this is the modern uh, customs dream. And why do I rip that lettuce? I guess it's decent enough stats. <clears throat> and I don't have the Tatsu Worm yet. So I don't have the build I was fully, fully going for. We copy a Badger. So in this case, the Wombat works against us. It's alright, you take the good, you take the bad. You take it all and there you have the facts of life. The facts of life when the world... Okay, Polar Bear, that's interesting. I think I should have sold... Maybe there was nothing in shop I wanted for the polar bear. We continue to take our elk value. The kiwi will be up to nine after this battle. What do we copy here? Did we copy a... We copy a cockroach, which gets us the win. Insane wombat. It's a, it's a, it'll be everything at once, it will. Whale, elk, insane sell value. And now I just need something to buff. There's the tatsu worm. We're all happy about it. <coughs> I want to remind you, the synergy I was going for, you will see that at the end. We copy a Nessie. <laughs> Your Nessie's kind of large. Uh, my Wombat's Nessie will be kind of large. 18, 18. That guy's uh, name is incredibly cringe. So we sell the whale. We're going to bring in the lower level Tatsu Worm. And give it some protection. I mean, a turn 9 Tatsu Worm is not what you should be doing. <laughs> In any capacity, but you know, we wanted this to be our build. We now have a Hoopo bird Which does enough In fact, it doesn't do enough. I totally lied. We're down to two health Now we rip our level. We'll freeze. We'll set up. We'll give ourselves as much gold as possible for turn 11 You know how it works We copy a deer. Give me my cell value. Level 3 bus 
I love your build, Nova Finch. But the bloody wombat does enough for me to draw. So here we go. Nice polar bear buff on her buy sell oyster. Inject. Now this is the unit I was looking to use. I wanted to use slug in front of Tatsu Worm, and I had a few other little tricks lined up. You'll see it at the end. But this time I'm like, dude, this is the wombat's time. Now we're gonna sell. Now we have 28 gold. Now we'll take our cat level. Buy sell stoat, we hit cat stunning. Absolutely stunning. What do I do here? Take our packer, sell this one maybe. Buy a Tatsu Worm, building up slowly. And you can see, like, uh, it's just like the classic elk power pivot. Why am I not buying that cow? I take television, that's interesting. Maybe that elk pivot is the reason I got Vertigo. There was a lot happening. Uh, and you can see... Basically, we're, at the moment, we're only getting an 8 damage snipe out of our Wombat, unless it copies a summon pet. But we do enough to win. And that's 5 hearts. Where are we going from here, Reverend, I hear you ask? Ah, uh, we're cat buffing. I'm looking for something... ...better to use my Alpaca trigger on, and I didn't even buy the cow, man. I think it's a bad freeze, like, I have a lot of food in my, uh, thing. We copy deer again. Which means we're going to get a 15-15 bus, and we're going to get a snipe, and then we're going to get another snipe, and it's starting to kind of cook. Six wins. Why do I still have the cow frozen? Great question. I use TV with a four squad? Questions are being asked. There is a certain pet I'm looking for to take this Tatsu Worm over the edge. Maybe you know what it is. And we still haven't found it, and we find it now. You know this new pet that, like, seems totally unneeded, but is kind of fun? The Albatross? <laughs> nice. And really, it's just a, wom a Wombat Tatsu Worm carry. Which you wouldn't expect to see. Now I can actually use my Alpaca here, which I'm assuming I do. No, I, I level an Oyster. That's something you could do. <clears throat> so in case you're unaware... Tier 4 or lower friends deal 3 extra damage. And that'll be 6 soon at level 2. So we're trying to turn these Tatsu Worm Snipes into Mega... Uh, Bodega Snipes. <clears throat> and unfortunately we're wasting gold because I really want this leveled. Ideally what I wanted was level 3, level 3, level 3. And then I had an even another little Razzle Dazzle I was going to put on it. We're going to copy <clears throat> Melon. Which is going to be enough... For us to win. It's just the Wombat domination. You know that you know they're nerfing the Wombat in the new patch? Makes me very sad. So I'm gonna do some buy selling. Now we're level two. Still haven't leveled up the Tatsu Worm, or no, I have now, I guess. Things and such. I can't quite get there, so let me use my cat value. So now this is dealing 12 damage when the Wombat dies, plus the Albatross 15 damage, soon to be 18. Free, free skeleton dog scaling. Thank you, Wombat. If you even kill me, I guess you do here. And <laughs> we get there. Wombat domination. Now we're going to level. Oh, we were close to getting at level 3. It's just, it, this build is a lot to ask. There's a lot of moving parts. And you know me. This is like a trademark of me at this point. If I don't get the exact build I'm going for, I'll just finish on a 3 squad, dude. We don't copy anything here. How much was that snipe worth? 12 add... Yeah, so it's 18 damage. But imagine if we copy deer again or something. We go to one health. It's lethal time. We'll just take some little stats where we can get them. I think you can make a case that I should be using cow on wombat just to get to that 50 attack threshold. But we'll settle for 49. Yep, we'll settle for 49. And let's see how we go. Will this Wombat Tatsu Worm Albatross get over the line? <clears throat> we copy Deer. Which means we pop Melon there. We deal another 18 damage. Oh, we actually lost. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was a fun run. It was an Alpha 3 squad to finish on. Let me pause. Let me show you what I was actually trying to do. Okay, you can see here it was a lot to ask... For me to get the level 3 slug 
and the level 3 Tattoo Worm, and the level 3 Albatross, and then I was actually pushing for level 3 Elephant Seal with Fairy Dust. So it jumps to the front and gives another trigger. Let's jump into this one. Uh, it was This build was a lot to ask. It was a lot, and then I got Vertigo, so you know what you're going to do. Let's go from... We actually only got the Albatross to level 2. Let's go... Let's go from, like, this battle, the first one where we got it to level 3. Let's pay attention to the damage. 18 damage. 18 damage. 18 damage. You beat me, you son of a gun. I think I should have fronted my elephant seal there. Anyway, let's just watch the rest of this run and we'll get to actually appreciate the synergy. Because I got news for you, buddies. I am not doing this build again. It's far too much to ask for in the current climate. Yeah, I'm just committed... I'm just committed four squad at this point in the run. You ruined everything! We might still win. Nah, the, the break points were bad. Look, this is this is actually a decent uh, example about why <laughs> you just don't get there. I'm asking a lot of myself, a lot of pivoting. Uh, look, I even get a potato just to try to stay alive. We pop. It's a really good counter having a gorilla. We were doing 18 damage at a time. You can see the synergy. I'd be I would love it if somebody else pushed this over the line. But anyway, we saw a cool wombat run. We saw a nice idea in theory. And we don't have Vertigo any longer, and they can never take that away from us. Goodbye.